What's going on, y'all? Just doing some some thinking, you know, driving in the truck now, 16, as usual. You know, I'm on a dedicated account. Yeah, I'm just thinking, you know, NBA and trucking basically means never broke again in trucking. Which means, which, which, which that means is, it's not like you about to become a millionaire or some shit like that trying to drive no trucks. But at the same time, the income is basically almost limitless. Because you got to think about it. Everything that's on your back, everything that's on your feet, everything in your house came off a truck. Truck drivers are in high demand, you know what I'm saying? So it's like, if you want to establish a career where, you know, basically you can make some good money, you know what I'm saying? But well, you can, basically you can make some good money relatively, you know, you don't got to go to no four-year college or nothing like that, you know what I'm saying? You can go like Savannah Tech, a couple of months, you know what I'm saying? Boom. There you go. You know what I'm saying? You got a career. Or if you want to do like a Swift or a CR England, which I don't advise, believe it or not, you know what I'm saying? Because you're going to be stuck in the contract for at least six months, which means you basically become, excuse my French, almost like they bitch. You know what I'm saying? And they would they want to, you know, they would want to be like, go to Canada. As the Canada, go to Texas. At the Texas, go to California. At the California, go to Idaho. At the Idaho, go to go to New York. And then we'll think about getting you home. You know what I'm saying? You know, and, you know, that's why I, I wouldn't advise anybody going to, you know, CR England or SWIFT or CRST or something like that. You know what I'm saying? Don't get me wrong. If you want to really um, develop a career and you don't have any kind of money or any kind of funds, I mean, you got to do what you got to do. You know what I'm saying? But I, I mean, I would definitely recommend anybody, man, woman, cat, dog, you know, if you're looking for to establish a career where you can make you making some straight money, some nice money, I would definitely recommend trucking. You know what I'm saying? Um, and don't get me wrong, I don't even know if I want to do this for the rest of my life. You know what I'm saying? That's why I was thinking about going to school to try to learn the logistics size of trucking. You know what I'm saying? Because a person who dispatches loads to truckers, they make just as much money as the truckers. You know what I'm saying? Because they're getting a percentage of every load that they dish out to a trucker. You know what I'm saying? That's why, you know, you try to develop, you know, you want to go to school to learn the logistics side of trucking. You know what I'm saying? You can still bring home about $1,500 a week. You know what I'm saying? Sure, shit. That's still some decent money. You feel me? So, I mean, any kind of anything that's involving the truck. But it's logistics. Can't even talk. <laughs> logistics side, or the driver side, or the driver manager side, or, 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 or dispatch side. Anything involving the truck, you making some decent money. You know what I'm saying? I know owner operators that's you know bringing home around about five, six thousand dollars a week. You know what I'm saying? A week. You know what I'm saying? So. You know, like, like a lot of y'all, y'all be thinking, y'all be seeing like these little, like the young, young damn, young niggas, I hate to say it like that, young black dudes, riding around with 20 inch rims or, or this and that and the third, candy paint cars, nice little rides and shit like that, they dope boys. Hell, a lot of them boys truckers. You know what I'm saying? I know that for a fact. A lot of them drive trucks. Y'all think they dope boys because they, they young, they black, you know what I'm saying? Oh, he must be a dope boy. He riding around in a 20, uh, 2018 car with, with some 20, with those 22s on it. Nah, he, he either like a trucker or he worked for at the ports or, or something like that in that kind of nature. You know what I'm saying? So it's money out here to be made, you know? And I'm still trying to perfect it myself. But yeah, man, I, I would definitely advise anybody, you know what I'm saying, you want a career, or whatever man man look in the trucking you know what I'm saying now what that I can say is what works for you might not work for the next person what's works for you I mean what's works for the next person might not work for you like for instance 
I currently drive for CR England. I like working at CR England. I mean, don't get me wrong. Every company has pros and cons. Every company has pros and cons. But to me, and I, I mean, to me, I mean, the, I mean, the, the pros outweighs the cons. That's why I'm still here. Because technically, I mean, I got 14 months experience. You know, I know my old videos and shit like that, I was with uh, CCC Transportation. I ain't had no experience. So I had no choice but to damn limp my way through getting some experience. You know what I'm saying? But I got 14 months, bro. I'm an established driver right now. You know what I'm saying? I could pretty much go almost anywhere I want. You know? I mean, there's a, a few other co it's a few companies that I still can't get into, you know, that they want me to have like two years, three years experience before they hire me. But at the same time, to the most part, I mean, I could get me a, a, a decent paying job tomorrow with my 14 months. You know what I'm saying? Because like right now, you know, for the moment, I'm satisfied with, with C CR England. You know what I'm saying? So, to each his own. You know? You might you might try to come to see our England. They might hate the shit. You know what I'm saying? Cause per, per, personally, if you let CR England train you, oh, you ain't gonna make no money. I mean, I tell anybody that shit. You ain't gonna make no money. If CR England trains you, and that don't be wrong. I I mean, I'm satisfied with CR England, but I'm just being I'm keeping it 100. If CR England trains you, or Swift trains you, or C C R S T C R S C T whatever the acronym is, they train you. You ain't gonna make no money. You know what I'm saying? Because you gotta think about it. You are a rookie. You know what I'm saying? You a rookie or apprentice, whatever the word you wanna call it. You ain't got no experience. So you're gonna make you gonna do a lot of you gonna you gonna fuck up a lot. You know what I'm saying? You're gonna be either late with lows or you might bump shit and all kind of shit. Hell, my first month, my first month driving the truck, I bumped the damn car. I mean it's just gonna happen. It's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. But shit, anyway, um, I'm let it go. I mean, I mean I'm mean, i gonna let this go. You know what I'm saying? I just wanted to holler at you because I know it's been a little second since y'all heard from your boy. But, you know, holler at me.